Um, time now to ask the expert here to answer your questions on money and marriage is financial advisor Angelica Prescott. Okay, first up, Allie from Peoria. My husband wants to eat out a lot, but it's very expensive. What can I do to make sure we don't wreck our budget with huge dining expenses? Well, that's really, really cool because eating out means there's something delicious that he enjoys. <laughs> How about we figure out the recipe for the things that you guys are eating out to do and make it at home? Yes. That could be a little tricky. And that's a nice little couples thing, it too. Is, to it like is. bond and it get is. Closer, it is. Yeah. There's a kale salad that I love. Don't mind me on kale. Oh, but it's good so good. It has craisins and all that kind of stuff. I learned to make it at home because it was $26 when I bought it. So Ooh. maybe creating that same recipe at home would work and yeah. also creating an account that's for eating out. And once it hits that dollar amount that you guys go along, Boom. Once yeah. it's at 120, we're going out to eat. Yes. Let's go. Oh, I like that. And it goes back to what we we're talking about, priorities mm -hmm. and seeing what's important. Okay. This viewer says, what's the best way for us to keep track of our individual spending to hold each other accountable? We are trying to save for a car mm -hmm. and aren't getting very far. Well, the key thing is your bank account, if you're assets are going straight into it, is going to tell you the secret sauce to what you're asking for. So let's look at it, separate your account, see what he's doing, she's doing, or however the couple is set up. Okay. And then from there, at the end of the month, assess what the statements are saying. Okay. Right? And now you have facts versus I think I spent and maybe I'm I did. I'm guessing. We got it on paper. Yeah, exactly. And seeing exactly yeah. what you can afford. Yes. Okay. Tom from Gilbert, what are the best strategies if you are in your late 50s, have some debt and minimal put away for retirement? Wow. This is yeah. crunch time at that moment. Yeah. So I would, one, recommend for professional help to be included because we cannot make a mistake. Mm -hmm. We do not have another 30, 40 years to plan for retirement. So getting professional help that's catered to that individual is key. Second, realize that retirement can happen not only in the U.S., but it can happen all over the world. So maybe there's a different place. Maybe there's a Costa Rica available. Maybe there's a different part of the world that you could retire in where it's not that expensive. Yeah. And you could stretch your Social Security check a lot further. Who knows? Mm. There might be a nice little Tropicana in your future. Awesome gonna say that is like living your best life what an adventure know. yeah new know. chapter mm -hmm. all right tina from phoenix we share the same checking account and sometimes my husband doesn't log his debts or checks mm. and i don't know what has been spent yikes what can i do well key thing is get a hold of those checks but more <laughs> importantly yes. discuss exactly what's coming in and if you have that sit down make a great dinner sit down and talk about it all right how much is really coming in what are you going to keep on your own and what are you going to bring into the household and once there's clarity on that, whatever he's keeping is known already, whether you see it in the account or not. Yes. Okay. You got to have that transparency. Full disclosure. Yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. Okay. Next up, Ryan from Scottsdale. Is it frowned upon in a marriage to have separate checking accounts? Ooh, that's a good one. Absolutely not. Please go forth and have yes. your separate checking accounts. Even have your separate fun accounts. Have your separate travel accounts. Have your separate, I'm going to buy an expensive oh. purse once I get to this dollar amount account. Yeah. Create a space where you have it all organized and nothing is hidden and nothing is hurting you because you planned for it. Okay, I always joke, but really I'm not joking. The key to a happy marriage, separate checking accounts yes. and separate toilets. All right. it's, just, it's safety there. <laughs> exactly. No surprises. I mean, <laughs> yes, exactly. And you don't want that. Angelica, you are amazing. Thank you so much. I'm going to see you next week. See you soon. Tackling debt. Okay, Absolutely. bye.